Good day. Happy humans. Happy humans. <laughs> this is day number one of furlough. Furlough and quarantine. Yes, Tyler's been well, furloughed Well, not from a quarantine. Job for the next but, month. Yeah, so I'm on furlough for the next month. But oh, she went back in. we also, as I was working outside we, we in the yard, came across this little kitten. It was oh so hungry. Yep. And she's going to be our outdoor cat. And I think we are going to name her. Furlough. And I was going to name her first name. That's you. Sparkles. <laughs> Furlough. Furlough Sparkles. So, day one of Furlough. I'm going to build her a little, build her a little shelter, I think. That's what we're going to do. Get over here. Yep, build her a shelter. We gave her some food. I don't want to bring her inside with the other cats because I just don't know. We don't know. Um, but obviously the cat has been very hungry. So can probably only eat so much. So we're gonna, yeah. Bump. We're gonna take care of her. Yep. You know what? What a great thing to do when, yeah. when you're at home. Take care. Of take care of something. That. So yeah, we'll build a little shelter. That should be like our. Elf. I don't know. I've got. Uh, that should be got our Some behind me ruins the light. Mm -hmm. I've got some old wood that I've used. Yeah, Actually, an old breakfast cat. bar that we had. So. Look at outside. The outside cat. Yep. <laughs> She can keep all the riffraff away, like Heathcliff. No. This is the old breakfast bar, so we'll probably make, a I don't know, we'll make, like a, we'll make like a little shelter type thing for her. Um, so she can be outside, or he, I don't know. She's, the cat is very, very skinny. It's a boy um, and girl name. But I've got some extra old pallets inside as well. So we've got plenty of cat food. I just don't want the cat to suffer. I'm not, I'm not that inhumane, but I'm going to move this big hunk of wood to the other side and probably cut some stuff down yeah. for the cat so she can stay dry. And I don't know, I've got this old door here too. That, that could be a window. <laughs> could be a window for the cat. She'll have the nicest, she'll have, she'll have the nicest outdoor <laughs> cat home of any cat that was found ever. She'll have a window to look out of. It'll be blocked in from the wind. We'll give her like a little bed. Yeah. All the food and water she wants. Why are you bringing your bike out, Drew? She just wants to ride. Josie just wants to ride her bike. So yeah. Beautiful day. It's a great day. <laughs> great day for a cat rescue. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That's furlough. Yep. It's starting to look a little bit better. Very affectionate cat. But I am working on cleaning this whole area up over here and giving the cat some type of shelter and we'll give it like a little area to sleep and all these other fun things. Yeah, we still got some more to clean up, but we forget what we're gonna do over here. Something, something. We'll get a bag, we gotta get back to that, so. This is a temporary little house for furlough. We put a little blanket and bed thing in there. Our indoor cats are going to be so jealous. But yeah, we'll see. Uh, the She's kids. Over there next to the see. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if he ends up moving on, I gotta. We'll make this little flower potting area. I think and put some flowers in the front of it. But I gotta notch this little section up back here so I can push this up against the wall. And then, because if it rains, I don't want the cat to get wet. Nobody wants that. So, yeah. He's definitely an affectionate cat. Yep, get some mulch and lower that out. You're all right. Yep. Yep. Yep, just make sure you wash your hands very well before we go inside to eat, guys. What are we having? It's lunch. Lunch. And Dad looks like he's um, cutting out a notch. Yeah, I cut out this notch right here so that I can push this all the way to the back. Oh, hi. 
So yeah, this was not <laughs> this was not our agenda today. It was not to uh, build this, but you know what? The side of the house has been junky, unfortunately, for almost way too long. So I'm gonna cut this out. Like I said, worst case scenario, the cat ends up going somewhere. Then we'll make this little cool flower garden type thing over here. So I think you're hanging outside right now, just chilling out in the hammock, right, Tatum? Yeah. Yeah. So this is the semi-finished product. Had a little bit of mulch left over, so I just brought some mulch over here. But you can see we put a little bed in there for the cat, and then food and water down there has a place to stay. So it may come back. It may come back. It may come back. Who knows? But yep, she uh, or he was running around in the yard earlier playing in the plants, which is fine. So, I don't know. Josie's doing her chalk drawings right now. Right, Josie? We're doing some chalk drawings. And I had some leftover sticks and wood that I might... Uh, Make a tic-tac-toe board out of. That wasn't the plan. Probably something I'll make so that the vines can climb up some, some oh, or something like that. So, yep. So the vines. So I'll get some string and tie stuff together. I don't have any staples. So cut some pieces up and we'll be good to go. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trying, trying to stay busy. It's not even. I don't even have a watch on. It's probably 2:30 right now. What? We are now chilling in the house for a bit. Um, <laughs> Josie's like. There we go, and we are going to watch Onward, because it became available on Disney Plus today, April the 3rd. So while they're watching Onward, I'm going to go work on some more of my Magic Kingdom video vlog, part one, chapter four. Well, they can't check, check it out when it comes out. But yeah, so they're going to chill for a while inside, it's only four o'clock in the afternoon, I felt like I've worked a full day. I feel like it's been very busy today. So we'll see you in a bit. So it's almost dinner time. Tatum is actually helping with dinner tonight. We're getting ready to, uh, as you can see, oh, yep, right there. We're going to make some shrimp pasta and I am going to show her how we're going to get this shrimp prep. Um, I think we're going to put a little bit of butter in it, right? Some garlic and then some rosemary and then we've got the pot going over there right now to get the spaghetti up in there. So we're going to wait till at least the water boils before we start getting the shrimp ready to go. Um, it won't be that hard. You're excited, right? Do some cooking. Learn some cooking from old Papa Bear. Fair enough, I didn't even know we were calling myself Papa Bear. <laughs> All right, so Tatum helped out with dinner. How was it, Teach? Good. Good? We did a very basic what? Just shrimp? Learning. With some butter and some garlic, and some rock salt. I don't know what you're doing, <laughs> Josie. You're being kind of crazy. <laughs> but yeah, it was good. And uh, Nicole reminded me that we have some mushroom and spinach. From last night, so we have some sauce from last night. I think we'll be really good on top of this. Yeah. So, that up. yeah. so or yeah, I don't know. The camera's not facing you. Yeah. April oh, Fools. Fools. April Fools on yeah. me. Three days late, James. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's all right. So I just wanted to give everybody an update on furlough the cat we um we decided to move him into our garage for the time being right yes we did we did he's very affectionate he has <laughs> yes he sounds like gary the snail from spongebob he's very vocal but he's gained some weight um he is not fixed though, so I don't want to put him in the house with our other young kitten that is not fixed. But we moved him into the garage because there have been coyote sightings around here. And uh, 
I don't want him to get attacked by any coyotes, huh? Can you come up here? Yeah. So he's been a good little cat. We visit and we come out and we play with him. I think the other cats kind of know something is going on. Um, but he's got a little litter box out here for the time being. Yes. And uh, he's very, he's very happy. He's purring all the time. He just looks much better than on day one. And uh, who knows? We are trying to find a home for him still. But who knows? There are no vets that are open right now for elective surgery, so we can't even have him fixed at this point in time. But he's a very sweet cat. I don't think he was a feral cat by any means. No. I think he was somebody's pet and was just neglected or kicked out. I don't know. It's unfortunate. Unfortunate. But he's, uh, he likes to give hugs too. Huh. Yes. You love giving hugs. So anyway, that's our little update on furlough. It's a couple days later. He's gained weight. He's looking much better. And, uh, you know, I'm sure we'll have more updates and videos with him in it later on. So, as we always say, guys, be a happy human. Peace out. Take care, guys. Say bye. Say bye. <laughs>